So hello my little hellions. How you guys doing? Yeah, last night, oh my gosh. Three o'clock in the morning. <laughs> I tried to go to bed early, I really do, but didn't even get everything done editing and stuff and then I screwed up on the one part. There's that little space or whatever and I haven't gone back to annotate it or anything, so I'm just I'm just gonna leave it. Oh, what a night. Um, but I was able to get a couple pictures, so if you guys haven't seen it, go back and watch a video from yesterday, and if you haven't seen it, I'm not going to tell you where we went or what we did, so go down to the bottom of the screen. So where's it at? Um, over there? Previous? Down there? I think? Hold on. Let me get it at point of view over here. Okay, yeah, whatever. Over there, over there. I'm kind of bass backwards right now. Uh, so right now I'm going to go over and, well, let me go back a little bit. I said this like maybe a week ago that during the week the weather's usually fine and then the weekend it starts to rain. They've been calling for rain for like, or showers, excuse me, for the last couple of days and it hasn't happened. And now, guess what? It's my weekend and that's what we've got going on. So the rain is coming but I'm still going to get to the prop car because I'm undercover and I need to get it done. I have plans to try to get it done within the next two months. And I've been working on it since September. So I'm not sure if that's going to happen or not, but I'm absolutely going to try. So anyway, I will get to that in a little bit. I'm going to go help my neighbor. Um, actually, I told him that I'd clean up his yard for him. So, yeah, I want to go do that. Random acts of kindness, absolutely awesome. So I'm at, obviously it's dark now, so I'm done with my neighbor's stuff. Took some time to, like, chillax. Or whatever the young kids are saying nowadays. Um, let's see, the first thing that I want to say is tomorrow I am going to be, hopefully, filming a small little clip of the prop car during the daylight uh, for Halloween form. I posted a thing about the prop car on there a while ago, and I'd like to get give, them, uh, give an update and uh, have people watch it. So there's going to be an extra video tomorrow, most likely. But the goal for tonight, yes, here's a wonderful prop car in the dark again. Tonight's goal, taking the uh, switch for the fog machine and getting it at least set up for the boo box because it's going to be attached directly to the boo box. Um, the other thing is, is I want to get the tail lights and I'm just showing you guys this. I mean, it, it's like a cluster F of wires, but I want to get the tail lights wired up and also the reverse lights wired up. So that's the goal for this evening. Oh, sorry. I kind of lost you there for a second. So we'll uh, see what happens with that. And I'll show it to you here when I'm done. Alright guys, so here it is. I am done for the night and awesome progress. The control for the fog machine is all zip tied up and it actually it goes to the front to the boo box. The boo box is not mounted yet because like I said I'm bringing it in at night and when I'm not using it. Uh, the tail lights are wired up and the reverse lights are wired up. So really cool stuff. So here we go. Here's the controller and I'm not sure if I told you guys or not but the uh, fog box controller, or the programmer rather, does not stay in the prop car. So this white cable, whoop, you can't see it. The, the white cable and the box do not stay in the car. They're simply to program the boo box. So the only thing that stays in there is the boo box. All right, let me get a light over here again to show you. I know, back and forth, back and forth. Cast and tug, cast and tug. All right. So here is the wiring for the reverse lights put into the power supply. Here's the line coming from the power supply. So you've got one wire that goes directly to the reverse lights. The other wire is interrupted by going through the relay. So one of the relays is done and connected. The uh, tail lights, one wire, and because on cars they usually share a common ground, so 
the rev uh, excuse me, the tail lights and the brake lights share a ground. So there's actually going to be two power supply wires going to it, and I hope it works. I can't remember. It's been a long time since I've done electronics. So hopefully it'll work just fine. Um, just make sure you don't get your positive and negatives crossed. If you guys do anything crazy like what I'm doing, you guys should do this. This is fun. Cutting the car is the best part. Is like, it was awesome. Anyway, so here are, I have, wait, tail light wiring. I have not put heat shrink on this part yet, and I'm not going to be able to. I'll just uh, use electrical tape. This part right here, I have put heat shrink tubing on, so it's not going to arc out, short out, whatever. So here's the awesome part. Oh, I got to pull this out of here too. I forgot about it. Soldering iron. Because I'm done for the night. Dun, 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 dun. All right. Oh, this is so awesome. All right. So this is the ScareMaster programmer. And listen. Ah. Okay. It would figure that the fog machine was reheating again when I try to show this. So I'll show this one right here. You've got the relay for the reverse lights. Listen. And watch. So this is now wired up. Through the boo box. And they are 100% done. So awesome stuff there. So all I have to do is program it. Ah, here we go. Here's fog machine. Listen. And uh, I'm not sure if you guys can see that or not. Oh, yeah, you can. Fog machine out the tail. So then I will go and close the trunk lid. And let's do a little programming, shall we? Um, so fog machine is going to be intermittent, just every once in a while. So if we start with recording and go fog machine, and oh, I'm going to bring this over here because so that you guys can see it. So let's see, reverse lights, fog machine. Okay, so fog machine just gets a little spurt every once in a while because if I was to do it like heavy, it would come out like this. <laughs> and that looks more like the car has a blown head gasket. <coughs> and I don't want people to choke on this stuff. <coughs> okay, so I want to let this clear out. And this is actually kind of cool because using that big fog box that I made allows time so when the fog machine is like it was doing just a second ago when it is reheating you're still gonna have fog coming out of the exhaust so that's like really cool so all right so little burst and I am recording I want to stop recording and I'm gonna do it again because I was screwing up so recording here we go with a little burst a little burst you're coming up on the car and Boom, there's reverse lights. The brake lights will come on before that, and you guys know that I haven't done that yet. So that's like totally awesome. Stop recording, go back and play it. Little burst from fog machine. And reverse lights. Which is really cool. And I'm over here, the car is right there. I'm not even next to the car. So yeah, awesome stuff. That's it for tonight as far as prop car goes. All right, guys, I'm going to wrap everything up for the evening, and, oh, you're wondering about the sunglasses. No, I'm not trying to be like Robbie XX, or excuse me, XX Robbie CXX. So there's a small shout-out, too, so what's up? Um, no, actually, I had a small incident at work. Uh, got something in my eye. My eye is, like, totally, like, gross right now, and I don't want you guys to see it. Even though this is a Halloween vlog, you know, this kind of gross is like gross and not like Halloween gross. So anyway, aside from that, let's get to the movie line trivia. Wouldn't it suck if I talked like that all the time? Anyway, all right, so the line for tonight. So you're here two days and you already tried to kill himself. You must have some kind of bedside manner, huh? 
And you guys are playing for a $20 Visa gift card and a Hellmouth 4 t-shirt. Contest ends approximately April, May. You must be a subscriber. Go and do it now. It is free. Send in the answer in the YouTube message. Correct answer gets the following hell points. First is five, second place, third, second, or excuse me, third place is second, and fourth place, and on is one. Scoreboard top five, Blitzer Brothers 46, Black Club Blitz 13 at 44, GK Eagles 10 to 16, Dionysia 12 at 16, and the Bald Squid at eight. If you guys ask me to repeat this, I will tell you no, because I can barely do it the first time. I will just let you read the rest of them. And I actually had to make a correction. Joy Z Gal is now at seven. I unfortunately forgot to add her points so that's my bad, and she did get three this last time. So, with that said, my ass is going to bed because I'm tired. But, uh, anyway, uh, tomorrow we will see you guys hopefully back here. And, uh, like I said, I'm going to be doing the video for the prop car tomorrow. Uh, i got some stuff going on in the morning, but, uh, basically, we'll see where the day takes us. So, we will talk to you guys tomorrow. Happy hunting. Grr. Arr.